Hey everybody, what's going on? I am back and I have a new topic for today, which is going to be back to school shopping. I know everyone's doing it. It's that time of year. I procrastinated a little bit this year, which normally I'm done by say the first part of July. It's only like the 15th. So, I mean, I didn't do too terribly bad. We did shopping at the mall. Hey everybody, out and about right now. I kind of just want to give you my view. My kiddos are over there. Uh, no makeup, so sorry. I look a, a hot mess a bit. I, coming to pick up my kids' school clothes that I ordered, the backpack, school supplies, all that good jazz. I'll be uploading a video later on today. I got some new products that I wanted to give a try. Um, some creams. The primer, the Jeffree Star said was amazing by Elf. Um, that should be in in a couple of days and I'll do a little review on that as well. But we are walking into children's place at the moment. So I will be back later. We got some clothes and things like that. Academy was our go-to for backpacks. Our kids tend to love those. And normally the little cups that they bring to school for their water, which was an amazing deal. We are back backpack shopping it's not mine that is the five-year-old we got a few items here we got my children that's presley bailey say hi hey. <laughs> she's got a backpack on too we're doing a little yep. boy shopping for my child that is with his daddy looking at fishing rods i will be back soon oh there's daddy okay oh. say hey. hey and i will tell you i had three different school supply lists to buy for. They all obviously have different items. I have kindergarten, I have fourth grade and fifth grade. Our other little one is going into kindergarten too. His mom actually grabbed all of that. So I got some of his school clothes and made sure he was good for the year on his clothes. So we kind of, you know, work together. We're a big blended family. Um, so we really do it together, which is pretty awesome. So I'm thankful for that for sure. And I will say also that I didn't know this until my husband told me because I'm trying to consolidate my list and say, hey, this is how many pencils everybody needs and this is how much paper everybody needs. He told me, he said, if you go on the Walmart grocery app where you can order your groceries and then go pick them up, you can actually do your school supplies there. So if you didn't know, now you know. Walmart grocery app, I ordered all of the school supplies. I picked them up tomorrow at 10 a.m. So I didn't have to fight the crowds. I didn't have to worry about, hey, they're out of this or they're out of that. I literally ordered everything through that app. Told you I want you part of my life and I'm as open as possible to. I'm so thankful for you guys. Thank you so much for watching and paying attention to my family and I really, really appreciate it. I would love if you would hit subscribe below and just come back for more. I do have so many more topics and whatnot to discuss. Today was just really a back to school conversation. Just, hey, this is what we did and this is how we went about it. And I hope the Walmart grocery app really helps y'all because honestly, fighting the crowd or doing it online, same price and you get the convenience of sitting in your vehicle, just waiting on someone to bring you the bags. You don't even have to load it in the cart, out the cart, back in the cart in bags, and then into the vehicle. You just have to load it from their thing to your vehicle. It's like a win-win. I'm pretty pleased with that. Like that makes me ecstatic as a mom. Oh, my camera has shifted. Oh, there we go, sorry. So that makes me ecstatic as a mom because that's a lot of work, especially with multiple children. I really hope that tip helps. Share it for sure. Um, I'm definitely gonna share it on all of my, my social media outlets. So that'll be something that I put out there and just let everyone know because it's helpful. I mean, it's, it is not easy raising children. First of all, I love my babies, but they totally do not prepare you. And they, I mean, the people that came before us, say our parents, grandparents, aunts, uncles, they do not prepare you for parenthood. Parenthood is like one of those things you're kind of just thrown into and it's like, hey, you know, little baby wheels, what are they called? Training wheels or off, have a great life. Learn it step by step. So hopefully it helps. Um, I did have another product, where did I put it? I went and I got a few different things. I did a little bit of an e.l.f. order for cosmetics because I'm trying to try different things. I'm not big on makeup. I did a little something today, it's nothing 
too much. Jeffree Star has been just inspiring me to live my best life and do a little face beat. A child, he is so much better than I am. But I'm digging the eyes. Like, he does a little undertone of color and whatnot. The only e.l.f. product I used with this would be the under eye concealer and then the highlighter here in, like, a triangle form. But I don't really know what any of that means, just to be honest with you. But I'm trying a few new products out. I told my husband, I said, look, let me test it out. All these people are trying new things and trying to make sure their skin is rejuvenated. I do use, obviously, facial scrubs. I have a cleanser from my dermatologist, and I also use CeraVe as my moisturizer, as like a lotion. I use Luvederm sometimes. It's like, you know, just whichever one I grab, but I definitely pre prefer CeraVe. It's very moisturizing, um, and it soaks right in, so it's not cakey or sticky or slimy or anything weird like that. I actually had my husband go because he was going to get a few things for the house, and I sent him on a run for a few things I wanted. He picked up this, which is L'Oreal Paris. Hopefully, y'all can see it good. It's Revitalift. So, it is a double lifting anti wrinkle moisturizing cream and ultra concentrated lifting gel it's basically telling me it's a one minute lifting for your face helps with wrinkles and all of that good stuff so you know at a young age let's just start i totally don't want to have botox where i can't move my eyebrows you see i got movement i can even do one i can't do this one oddly enough but that's neither here nor there i'm gonna test this out i'm gonna give it a roll I'm gonna give it a good seven days. So today is day one for me. Once I, you know, do my makeup removing wipes, I wash my face and all that before bed. I'm gonna give this a shot. So just one more look at it if y'all want to see. I will do a seven day trial. So I'll do a little post each day or a little picture at minimum each day just to make sure that I'm doing, you know, somewhat of a transformation video, but not really that. It's just a trial and error phase. If it doesn't work, hey, we can try another one. No big deal. But I will post that as well. That will be upcoming next. Please do not forget to subscribe below. Hit the bell. You'll get notifications when I do upload another video, which should be, I would say, Wednesday, Thursday-ish. Somewhere in that time frame. Um, probably Wednesday, though. I really want to give this cream a good a good go for a few days and then give y'all an update on that. And then the following weekend should give me my, like, seven-day period or Monday, 70 period, but I will definitely do that. And if y'all have any questions about like how I did the school supply order, um, how to get the Walmart grocery app on your phone or your iPad or whatnot, I can definitely help you with that. Just, you know, comment below, shoot me a message, DM me, Snapchat. I actually recently did a Snapchat. So it's Fab and Perfect Mom for that and that'll pull up the new Snapchat for the channel. I also still have the Instagram, which is Fabulously Imperfect Mom and also Twitter, which is Mom Fabulously. So, hey, y'all check me out. Come on, follow me, like me, let's do this together. Questions, concerns, anything you got, I don't care if it's technical or not, I am technically inclined. So let me know and then I will talk with y'all soon. Have a good one, guys. Bye.